fishy. They're all looking so fishy. And not in a good way. Oh, that's even worse. Oh, shit. <laughs> mm, thank goodness I did not do that in public. People are going to start pointing the finger and blaming me for having the coronavirus. Coronavirus! Hey, y'all. Hey, it's your girl, Zoe. And in this Sims 4 video, we are doing the Breed Out the Weird Challenge. I was going to call it the Breed Out the Ugly Challenge, but I don't think that's politically correct in the year 2020. So we're just going to stick to calling it Breed Out the Weird Challenge. Normally in this type of video, you make an ugly sim or a weird, weird sim and then mate with a very attractive sim and see if each generation the sims can get prettier and prettier until all the weird traits and attributes of the sims are bred out. But when I record my videos, after about 10 minutes, my computer starts squealing. and it just does not like OBS. So instead of actually playing in a game, we're just gonna go into create a sim and play around with a little bit of genetics and just randomize each generation to see if we can breed out the weird that way. So let's get started. <laughs> no, 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 no. So I pre-made a sim already and we have Miss Poppy Dove. Um, honestly, I don't even think Miss Poppy Dove is that weird. I mean, is you blind? That nose is something. Mm. But other than that, Miss Poppy Dove, I mean, she looks kind of cool. But for the sake of this video, let's just call her weird and let's breed the weird out with an attractive sim. And let's see by three or four generations of playing with genetics, all her weird attributes will go away. So let's see if that can happen. So I'm just going to go into the gallery and just download a random attractive sim. I mean, okay, Miss Linda. Does Miss Linda have a little secret? Because uh, she looking a little sus, not going to lie. Oh, she is gorgeous. Oh, my goodness. Okay, but let's find a attractive male. A lot of these sims are looking a little um, feminine. You know, I like a rugged, masculine man. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mr. Nico. That, now that's my type of man. Rugged, a little hairy, sexy. Yes. He looks like he can go into the country and shoot us some good old deer. So we're going to pick Mr. Nico here. The thighs are... Um, the thighs are a choice. Choices. We have Miss Poppy Dove and then we have Mr. Nico. So we are going to play around with their genetics and see if we can breed out the ugly. The weird. The weird. If we can breed out the weird. So we're going to use the teen age and start randomizing their child. One. Two. Three. Okay. We have Daquan. He's honestly not bad at all. What the heck? How did the nose go away already? Okay, we already bred him out. What the heck? It took one try. I guess her genetics were not strong at all. Oh, hi, Mark. Let's move this ridiculous thing off. All right, well, you know, his head's a little thin. Ugh, that ponytail is a choice. Choices. But honestly... He doesn't look bad at all. So let's give him a quick little makeover and see if we have mastered this challenge already. I kept the pants and I just changed the shirt and his hairstyle. But we have Mr. Daquan. So this is only the first generation of Sim. And I think we've already won the challenge. I mean, he doesn't look weird at all. He looks simply normal. I mean, if even if we change his hair color to, let's say, like, brown he literally looks completely normal the nose went away he has a little overbite or is it an underbite he has a little a bit of an underbite but you know what with a little jaw construction that is completely fixable in the 21st century but let's still continue with this video until we get to the third generation and see what the results will be by then so we are going to now download a girl sam to breed with mr daquan and we're gonna go with the sexy mermaid here because she was gorgeous i think they have a lot of cc so we might have to uh change her hairdo okay yep 
basically everything she was wearing was TC. <laughs> but we have Miss Shannon Royer. We're just gonna add the blonde hair. I put on a new hairdo and dress for Miss Shannon. So let's now play with Daquan's genetics and see if we can breathe out the rest of the weirdness. All right, so now take in Shannon's and Daquan's genetics and we're going to age arson up to a teen and randomize three times. So one, two, three. Bruh. Oh, that's even worse. All right, so we finally got rid of the pink hair. So we were able to breed out the pink hair. Um, I can definitely see the mom's face now, more so than anything. So it looks like the mom's genetics were apparent. So we got the mom's face with the dad's nose. And why does he look more weird than Daquan? I feel like, you know, his head's a little small. He's looking a little um, blowfishy. If I'm, if I'm being honest here, he looks a little blowfishy. But let's give him a slight makeover and see if we can fix him up just a little bit. Oh my God, oh my God, I wanna give him plastic surgery so bad. I don't think her genetics <laughs> was a good idea. Those, that eyebrow bone is serious. Like I thought my eyebrow bone was bad, but. Mm. Oh shit. <coughs> <coughs> Thank goodness I did not do that in public. People are gonna start pointing the finger and blaming me for having the coronavirus. Coronavirus! So let me not choke on my drink, especially in public. Um, and a side note, I just realized that um, we kept choosing the male genetic, which is boring, but we're probably already like eight minutes into this video, so I don't really feel like doing this video all over again. So I guess we're just gonna have to stick with the male genetics even though it's boring. Like male sims are just boring, let's be honest. But let's download one more sim from the gallery and see if we can breed out the weird altogether. I want to be a cowboy, baby. I want to be a cowboy, baby. Hey, girl, how are you? We are going to mate with Jenna Cowgirl. She is too cute. If this is not Kate Denson realness. Come on, Kate Denson. So our last round of playing with the genetics. Let's see if we can breed out <laughs> the weird challenge. All right, one two, three. Ah, okay. Okay. You know, the profile's a bit questionable. It's a bit, a bit questionable, but frontal, the frontal view looks pretty darn good. Uh, okay. All right, James, we got James Cowgirl up in here. All right, let's see. Let's give him a cute little hairdo. Hmm. That one. Oh my goodness. Hi, sisters. Oh, this gives him a little volume on top because he does have a very <coughs> small round head. Okay, so we're, we'll stick with that that one. Let's see if we need to change the eyebrow. Ooh, girl. This eyebrow genetic is serious. Oh my goodness. I think I chose the wrong female to start breeding with because now we're stuck with her genetics. Lord. Well, we definitely breeded out the weird. The weird is out there. Poppy Dove's genetics, um, I guess, were not as strong as I thought they were going to be because with the first generation, I mean, the weird basically was bred out. I mean, the weirdest thing about her was that nose. And the nose was completely erased in the first generation. And then the second generation, the mother, not Poppy, but the, um, the random mother, the attractive mother, her genetics then took over, which then turned into a whole nother weird situation. And we ended up with James. Hi, sisters. We started off with Miss Poppy Dove and ended up with Mr. James. He has no resemblance whatsoever of the original weird Sim Poppy Dove. So I say that this video was a success. Alrighty, I hope you enjoyed this video. This was just a quick 
read out the weird challenge. Um, if I do this video again, I'll probably stick with this style of the video, which is playing with the genetics in the cast system. Um, and maybe in the future, I'll actually, you know, like go into a game and then mate with a sim and breed them by getting pregnant and playing out their life. But like, that's just a lot of work and we just don't got time for all that. Again, Miss Poppy Dove, for the sake of this video, I called it Breed Out the Weird Challenge. Other than her nose, I think Miss Poppy Dove looks really cool and I might want to do a Let's Play with Poppy Dove and give her the best life that she deserves. So, I don't know. I might do that in the future. We'll see. Check out my other Sims 4 videos. I will leave a playlist in the link below. Share, like, subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see y'all later. T-dubs.